Paper cups has a wide range of use, starting from hot and cold drinks to take away paper fried chicken bucket and can be found in the majority of fast food restaurants and coffee shops. When you cut out a paper cup to bring it back to its original flat shape, you will notice that the top and bottom edges is curves. Now the question is how these curves created, on what measures it depends. How to fit my design on them correctly. In this section, we will explain everything starting from the smallest detail, so you can understand how to draw the die line with learning an easy and simple equation to get the right size customer need. Whatever the size is, and how to fit your design correctly without the need to search or ask for die line. Instead, you will create it yourself. In general, the customer will send some data to you. You will need three important measurements. The first one is the diameter of the top circle. The second is the diameter of the bottom circle. And lastly, the height of the cup. Now, to start from these measurements, you need to get the circumference of the top and bottom circles. You can use the circle formula to get the circumference. Now, the circle formula is C equal 2 pi R or C equal pi D. C is circumference, pi the constant, pi approximately 3.14, R radius of the circle, D is the diameter of the circle. So if you have these measurements, then you can design any cup, whatever the volume is, as you will see in the next video. So you need to concentrate carefully to understand the steps. These steps will look like many, but it's not. It will be very easy when you understand it. So bring a cup of coffee and let we start.